Hello guys, my name is Gaming Tube One One One. Today I'm gonna show you how to make this car. It's pretty powerful. Really good at drifting. You can see my drifting is rather accurate and rather good. So let's get to it. First thing you need to do <laughs> sorry about that Liz. First thing you need to do is go down to the auto show. And you need to be able to select, if you haven't got this map pack, then I suggest you download it, otherwise you won't be able to make it. I think the map pack is the pre-order pack, if I'm not mistaken. Now, you're going to head over to the 370Z, and you're going to click on it. Oh, this is a drifting tutorial as well, so, and how to make it. You're going to want to make it white or any other colour of your choice. I'm make mine white. And you're going to click yes after a time to free round. Free? Three? Free? Free? Free, <laughs> free round. Boom, ba da boom, 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 boom. Right. And what you're going to want to do, you're going to go accelerate on my ah! No, I'm joking. You're going to go down to the garage, 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 whatever, Americans, Germans, English, Slovakians, what? And you're going to want to go click back, and then you want to go click custom upgrades. And you want to go click aero and appearance, and you're going to click any front bumper that you want. I'm going to choose this one. Then I'm going to go pick this spoiler here. This spoiler here is the, the best one for the free center Z, trust me. And I'm going to go ahead and click this back bumper, which looks like spoilers. And this one. And to make a drifting setup, you would need no grippy ties at all. You're going to make the front ones grippy for better handling. Then you're going to change any room style you want. I prefer personally either these ones here or these ones here or these ones here. I like these ones the most. I'm going to change that to that big rear one. I'm just going to the same. Then you want to go upgrade everything else. Not fully upgrade it. In the end, this should turn out to be an R3 or an S. I'm not sure. Let's check if the volume's okay. Gonna wanna fully upgrade this again. Now you're gonna wanna change it really low. Got a rally pack like me. You wanna still make it there. You wanna. Do that, that, make it really light if possible, taking everything out. Right now, you're going to want to race, everything race, don't, don't get ready. Right. Now, you want to go click twin turbo. Now, you're going to want to click that. Then, you're going to head over to the engine again. You want to fully upgrade the Nissan GTR engine. Now you're gonna keep doing this, keep doing it, keep doing it. Then you wanna finish with done, yes. You wanna leave the garage, garage, whatever it's called. Now you're going to want to look, look how good this is of drifting. If it's not drifting very well, it's probably because you've got traction control on. What that does is improve your grip. So you're going to want to head over, it's the fourth one down, you're going to want to turn it off. And if it just keeps automatically changing your gear, I advise. Oh, what's that word? Demo. Demo. Uh, 
put it on manual. So you can drift in with the OBM works. You're going to make it like a, you saw at the start. Put on the design creator. Paint your car like that colour, like that. You want to paint it black, and paint the mirrors black, paint the spoiler black, paint the wheels black, window tint, capacity 60. No, it's 59 compared. <coughs> then you're going to want to type in carbon fibre on the, the zone shell up thing. Oops. Add decals, yep, add decals out. You want to click that, then add one of them. You want to download carbon fibre, any carbon fibre you want. Can't find my one, who cares? Anyone, You want to make it as small as the bumper, a bonnet, sorry, silver door. It. Oh yes, if you want to make it look like it's been backfiring, um, you're gonna to want to get, gonna to go to gradient shapes, gradient shapes, whatever that says up there. You're gonna gonna click the uh, one, two, three, four, five, six one, and the third one down. You want to make that black. Then what you want to do is you want to click Y, make that really thin. Click Y there. Oh, there. Move this. To the like that. Click OK. And I've got my own number plate thing, so I'll play that. GB next, and British. And proud. And I'm going to go to loser. Which should fit straight in there like a bounce. That looks pretty cool. Japanese cars never usually have a, well they don't have a front um, number plate so they make their bumpers like this. So there's like nowhere to put it. I'm going to want to leave the paint shop and look at this badass car and it should be done. This may take a few seconds. how good this looks then guys, uh, loser, backfire, uh, just drifting around there, carbon fiber bonnet, if I had time I would show you the top speed which is around 200 miles per hour, something like that, thanks for watching guys, gaming stuff, one one out, one one out, out, out.